Hey everyone, so welcome to my summer vacation video. In this video, you'll see me traveling to four different places in Canada. So I hope you enjoy, and let's begin! So the first place I went to was Quebec City, in Quebec, and I went to downtown, and here are just a couple buildings we went to. This is what we had for dinner around 10.30ish. I know it's really late. This is what my mom had for dinner. It's salmon with rice. I had lobster sandwich, french fries, and salad. And this is what I had for dessert. I'm not sure what it's called, but it was really, really sweet. So here are just a couple of random pictures that I took with my iPhone. So the next place we went to was New Brunswick and the first place we went to was New Brunswick's McDonald's and we had a lobster sandwich which only exists in Maritimes. And uh, this is just one of the places we went to, I forgot the name, I think it's Hopewell. What you see here is a weird looking seaweed thing stuck onto a wall and you'll see a close up view of that soon. Um, I call this a chocolate river. I'm not sure what the full name is. Here's a video. Uh, there's my feet. And the river, the, I mean the sea really is, uh, really is like a chocolate-y kind of color. Looks like chocolate milk. Here is the seaweed up close. I squished one of them um, by accident and some kind of uh, liquidy kind of stuff came out. It was sort of disgusting. But yeah, here and here is a picture of a bunch of them. Give you goosebumps. Mwah. So this is what we had for dinner. It was lobster, a bun, uh, butter dippings, and a salad. And what I had for a drink. Drink? Just a random picture of a drink. <laughs> so after dinner, we went to the beach that was near the restaurant. Um, the water was really, really warm. But we only sadly stayed there for a couple of minutes. Because we had to get to our motel. Uh, and then this is the Confederation Bridge off to Prince Edward Island. And here's just a quick snapshot of it, or video. It is about 13 something kilometers, kilometers, however you say it. Um, we got to Charlton in Prince Edward Island. This is the Parliament Building, and inside of it, um, all professional looking and stuff, um, we had a guided tour uh, from a lady, and I only listened to probably like 14% of what she said. I was taking pictures the whole time, but yeah Not that great. I was using my iPhone to take all of these pictures in Charlottetown um, They have a cow's ice cream store and it's named best ice cream store in Canada um, Here's a Catholic Church, I believe also in Prince Edward Island Charlottetown So for dinner we had uh, fresh lobsters, five or six. And the next video you see, this video is going to make you laugh. Um, it's called water balling, whatever you call it. Um, I'm not sure, but this is still in Prince Edward Island, um, and I had to pay eight dollars to get in. And this was pretty interesting. Like you go inside a big ball filled with air, and then you go into a pool and you try to stand up, do whatever you want inside the ball, it's really fun. Um, I was in there for 5 minutes, you only get to go in there for so long. Okay, so right now you're going to see me fall on my butt so many times.
Now I have to say that this is not as easy as you think it is. <laughs> Balancing side of the ball is pretty complicated because it is ball for one. Oh look, I did that for like, it's running up for like three seconds. Impressive, huh? New high score. Um, anyways, um, and then there's someone pushing me in. When I finally got to the corner, someone had to push me in. And then I try to stand up again. And then I think I fall. Um, yeah, because you don't get a flat bottom. It's a ball cylinder. So it's pretty hard standing up. And you're basically rolling back and forth, back and forth. Um, yeah, anyone who has tried this before know how complicated it is. You need a great skills of balance. Okay, so this gets her interesting. Um, Kevin keeps, keeps on pushing me and I tell him to stop. Oh, look! New high score! Yay! Yeah, as I said before, it's not like a cylinder where you have like uh, flat bottoms. This is a spear, so it's really hard to balance in it. And I'm like the oldest kid in there, so it's sort of embarrassing. <laughs> Um, not that being there is embarrassing. I mean, like compared to other kids, if there were like a, it was if there was an adult in there, I would be less, you know. But anyways, I was having fun no matter what, and I definitely would want to try this again if I ever see anything like this again. And I have to say, I felt like a hamster um, in those spinning wheel thingies. Except for I could not keep my balance and keep on running. I could, however, keep on crawling. There's that dude in the green shirt rolling around. So you see, I'm sort of getting the hang of it. I can run and stand up in it for more than a second, which is pretty impressive for myself. I'm not a circus girl, so I can't exactly have, I don't exactly have great balance. And there's this dude bringing me back because it's time to go. And um, I only paid eight bucks to get in, I think, which is not a lot. Um, and I stayed there for five minutes. And here comes another person, and boom, crashes me too. And then I get on. <laughs> and then once the person like, unzipped the zipper on the ball, um, my ears popped. So this is the dinner we have, yummy lobster. And then after dinner, we went to the lovely beach. I forgot the name. The sunset was beautiful. And then the next day, we went to um, Anna Green Gables author Lucy Montgomery, I think. The house that she lived in. And here is just some pictures. Um, old piano. Some of her... Um, I think these are like the original printings of the books that she wrote. And then there's just something she made. Uh, this is her room. Of course, it's not everything original in there. They definitely redid the wallpaper. This is another random room. I don't know whose room is that. 
Um, and then I really somehow love the the feeling and the texture and the appearance of old paper, so I had to take pictures of it. So this is what we had for lunch. I didn't eat too many because I don't really like oysters and clams. Um, this is one of the cows um, ice cream shop. They sell potato chop, um, potato chip covered with chocolate. And then after that, um, we went out of uh, Prince Edward Island to Nova Scotia, and we took um, a big boat with a car in it. So we rolled our car inside the boat, and then got on top of the boat um, on the very top level. Let's see what it was like. The boat is really, really noisy. Oh, it's not called a boat. It's called a ferry. Sell me. It's called a ferry. Um, we took a ferry across from Prince Edward Island to Nova Scotia. And here is the ride almost ending. The back is um, opening. We took the last spot in the boat, which we were pretty lucky to. Our car is like jammed in the edge. So once we got off the ferry, we rode to our motel, our cottage, and this is just a film of me taking it inside the car. And then you'll see everyone inside the car, and also, yeah, just random. And then we went hiking for two hours, and when we got on top of the mountain, it took about an hour or so, it was absolutely amazing. They built stairs, sort of, kind of things, um, down, on the bottom mountain all the way to the top and if we turn around in the video you'll see in a second um, you can see the road that I passed on to get to my motel um, our cottage and this is where I'm standing it was pretty scary because just one more step and I could die just saying <laughs> um, and this is what we had for I think dinner and yeah um, this is the last day um, it's not Sydney actually it's still in Nova Scotia um, and we just uh, stopped at a rock, big, big, ginormous hill of rock, and it was really quite beautiful. I was the only one who went down, like, like where my feet can almost touch the water. Um, everyone else stayed at the top. Um, so yeah, that's my video. I hope you like this video, and this is a random picture for Lily. Um, if you have any questions, please comment in the comment section below. Again, please comment, rate, and subscribe. I love you all. Thanks for watching.